Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we have something very, very exciting. It is a mystery wish haul. So my boyfriend actually just went on Wish and ordered a bunch of products for me without me knowing or seeing anything. So we'll be opening these together and let's see what we got. Opening our first package, I have some scissors here. So there's a bunch of little packages inside. Grab in the first one. There's no description on, so. So the first thing we got is this little contour brush. Next package feels like sponges. It's a makeup cleaning sponge. Next. Honestly, I knew not, well, I didn't know anything. He's just chosen colors and chosen products, so. <laughs> it's quite daunting, but that's why I've just put some foundation and did my eyebrows so that we can apply the makeup when we're done. I don't know if this is for me or if it's for him, but there's some foot masks, two of them. <laughs> I'm assuming that's for him and not for me. And then, ah, uh, a makeup cleaning pad. Uh, I really needed one of these. This is a two-in-one lip liner and matte lipstick. Oh, the liner is a bit broken, but that is what it looks like. And the matte lipstick is a nice pink movie color. And the next package, let's get a cut into something. I'm assuming this is for him as well because I wouldn't use this and it's a, a eye mask to sleep in. Moving on to the next packet. I've actually always wanted to try Wish but honestly I just get so scared because the shipping takes ages and you never really know the quality that you're gonna get but he's ordered off Wish before so he was confident in it. But Again, we have a bunch of goodies. Oh, this has a description on it and it's a lipstick. <laughs> oh, it's actually a mascara. It's Max Volume Black Mascara. Really cute packaging. Look at that. And, oh, really, really nice wand. Look at that. That's really nice. I can't wait to try that. This one says lipstick as well, but we've been duped before. And this is a, la a lipstick actually. It's called Miss Rose Matte Lipstick. Looks like it's in pink, although it's called Mimosa. Ah, love that packaging. And it's also in the same pink. Let's do a swatch of that. It doesn't feel too bad. And that is that color. Next it says eye patch. <laughs> Ooh, some collagen gold eye masks. These are really good if you have really bad bags. Just put them in the fridge and then take them out when they're cold and they do wonders. Next, description says bottle. I'm assuming that's an eyeliner. It says ultra strong waterproofing, Kadal, use a flower. Oh, yes, it's one of those Arabic eyeliners. Make sure eyes super black. Next package, some ear candles. <laughs> I don't know if they will work, but we've been dying to use these, so we'll see and I'll let you know. Oh. Next, we got some pretty disposable masks. And we got some nose blackhead removers. This next one is an eyeshadow palette. It says mini 15 color eyeshadow. It feels really light. Oh, it's all in shimmer shades. That is what it looks like. I like some of these colors a lot. But we'll apply that once we're done looking at all the packages. So 
So this is again by Quibest. Quibest. Best. Quibest. Quibest. Uh, which I actually got from Amazon the last time as well. And those were lip liners. But this looks to be a liquid lipstick. That's what it looks like. And it is soft matte lip cream. And that's what the Dauphin Noir looks like. And that is the color. I have some options for lipstick today. Oh, I love these. So these are jelly crystal lipsticks. It's more like a balm. Look at the packaging. So cute. And that is what it looks like inside. It's usually more like a... Ooh, that's really pretty. It's like a sheer pink. Put some of that on. It's really soft like a lip balm and it smells like peach or more like a gloss love that so next we'll just move on and do the eyes with the palette that we got and I will just complete the rest of the makeup off camera and then we'll move on to the lip okay guys so I've already just primed and set my eyes and because, I don't know, I put this little lip jelly on and my t-shirt. I'm quite inspired by the purple and the pinks. So, gonna try a small fluffy brush. But I'm going to start with this deep purple over here. See if we can pick any of that up. I think, I think let's start with no setting spray. And then we'll add some if there is a lot of fallout. So... I'm going to start today with my eye that I'm not so good at controlling and we're just going to place that in the outer corner. It seems to be really pigmented. I'm transferring pretty well without any setting spray and we're just going to move that along the brow bone or the crease. I've actually only dipped into the pan like two times so I think that is pretty good for a wish product so once it's a little bit less on the brush we're just gonna try and move it a little bit higher towards the eyebrow then with a flat brush I'm gonna dip into this shade just above the deep purple which is also a kind of purpley color and just picking some of that on our brush and I am going to use some setting spray on this so just giving it a little spritz we're gonna place that just below the other purple shade and I'm just going to use a patting motion because I do want that to layer up very nicely and just using a little dab motion and blending that into the other shade same thing on the other eye Oops. then just using the other side of the brush i'm going to dip into this pink over here it's like a peachy pink and the shimmer looks a lot bigger so like more glitter but we'll dip into that pick some up on the brush and then again spray it with some setting spray and we're gonna place that in the middle of the eye it actually looks white on the eye with a pink shift and just blending that into the other shade for a nice smooth transition I'm just going to take this purple brush that we used previously for the first shade we put down and I'm just going to blend out the edges. Then for the inner third of the eye, I'm going to go for this champagne colour over here, just on another clean flat brush, picking some of that up again and spraying it with some setting spray and placing that on the inner third just moving it up into that first transition color then taking our first fluffy brush again we're gonna dip into this orange here 
on the same brush and pick some of that up and we're going to layer that on top of the first purple that we lay down just to make it pop a little bit and just doing that on the outer edges all the way to the inner corner it's been a little bit experimental today so moving on we are going to use this eyeliner we got for a wing liner I haven't used one of these in years. Obviously I used to put it in my waterline when I was younger, ended up looking really Asian, but um, yeah, I don't know. It is very soft and actually comes off quite easily, but we're just gonna use that on the lash line. We are just gonna grab a little applicator brush and we're actually just gonna try and smoke out that lash line and I'm going to dip into this very dark black almost shade and we're just going to pick some of that up on here and we're going to use that over the top of the eyeliner just to smudge it out a little bit And then taking a small little angled brush, we're just gonna drag it out and give it a little baby wing. Next, we're just gonna apply some of this mascara just to the top lashes. And let's see how this goes. Hopefully my eyes don't burn out of my head. It is very wet, but most new mascaras would be, so hopefully it doesn't transfer onto my eyelids just yet. That is actually really nice. It's separated all my lashes and lengthened them. I just don't know if it will, like I said, transfer. Okay, so off camera, I'm just going to do my bronzer and highlighter and blush, and then we'll come back and finish the eyes and then move on to the lips. So coming back, we're just gonna complete the eye, or the lower lash line as always, but we're gonna do it a little bit different. We're not gonna follow the same transition as we did on the top lid. So we're gonna go for something a little bit different. So uh, firstly, I'm gonna dip into this bronze shade over here and that we're just gonna place in the outer third of the eye. Take some of that down. Then using the other side of the brush, we are going to dip into this goldy orange shade over here and that we're going to place in at the middle of the eye. Then really mixing things up, just taking a just another small brush. I'm going to dip into this green shade over here and that we're going to place in the inner third of the eye. Then for inner corner highlight, we're just going to try and use this pan. So I think I'm going to go for this really pale yellow goldy shade, basing it on the tear duct. And again, just taking the same brush and we'll just place it underneath the eyebrow. Then we'll just apply some a mascara to the bottom lashes. This mascara wand is actually amazing. I haven't got any mascara on my face, which is amazing. And usually when you have a brand new mascara, it gets very wet like this one is, but it hasn't transferred anywhere. Next, we need to do lips. So I already had that balm on, but obviously we wanna do something a bit different. <laughs> so we have these three shades. And I think we'll just try them all on and see how they look with the look. I think we'll try this one first without any lip liner. So it smells like like baking goods. I'm pretty sure 
my makeup smelled like this when I was younger. <laughs> so that is what that looks like. I really actually do like the color and it seems to go with my outfit, but we'll just take that off and then try on the next one. The next one I'm going to try is this duo lip liner and matte liquid lipstick. I'm not sure if this will suit my skin tone because it's quite light. It's just lining the lips with the lip liner. It's also a bit hard and not really doing much. So just line the lips and we'll apply the matte lipstick. This one is very liquidy. So that's what that color looks like. I don't think it suits me at all. Mm -mm. Not for me. So lastly, we have this pretty pink one and my lips are really sore now because of that lip liner. It literally <laughs> dug into my lips. This one smells like talc. So this is the finished look using all the wish makeup we got today in our little mystery box. <laughs> Okay guys, I really hope you enjoyed the video today. Everything here was new to me. I've never ordered from Wish before. Obviously, my boyfriend ordered a bunch of stuff that we would obviously use at a later stage, not right now. Um, he ordered a back brace as well. And like I said, the ear candles and the face masks and yeah, so this is all the makeup he'd chosen of course i chose the colors but i really did like it i really did enjoy it and please let me know if you'd want to see any more of these videos and by the way if there's any of my supporters who are weebs let me know if you know where these earrings are from anyway that's it for me have a great day everyone bye